morning, sunshines. Okay, so um, I'm gonna do a video today about dreadlock maintenance um, for new growth. Uh, personally, I have very fine hair, so when the new growth comes in, it's extremely noticeable. I find a good piece to do today. Maybe one up at the front that you guys can see. Probably this one's a good one. As you can see, it when it when my hair grows in, it's like really fine. It's really hard to get it to knot up without a little bit of help from my dandy crochet hook. Now I have some other videos out there that show how to um, make your dreadlocks and how to attach your dreadlocks. Um, and I use the crochet all the time. That's what I use the crochet method. I have personally found it to work the best. I've had dreadlocks for a long time. There are many other great ideas out there. You just have to find one that works for you. This one works for me. Uh, yeah, see my nice little coffee stain? I cannot wear white, so my hair is gonna be covering that. Okay, so here we go. So what I usually do, because my hair is so fine, is I have to knot it up a little bit at the root. So I just go like this, And I keep just turning it around in a circle like that, circular motion, and then I go in the opposite direction. And I just keep doing that right on my scalp until it gets knotted to where it's knotted enough to get the crochet hook through it and to make a little bit of a difference. Okay, so then I take my crochet hook, and hopefully you guys can see this because I'm not looking, and I put it through And I just go like this. So basically what I'm doing in there is I'm just going like that. Going like this. Going like this. And that's going to tighten it up right where I knotted it. Now if you do know how to crochet, it's basically just like a single stitch. If you don't, you're just going like that. Now my other videos will show you um, when I'm doing the um, adding the extensions, how I go all the way in and pull it all the way out the other side. I don't do that with the new growth. All I do is put it in there and basically what I'm trying to do is just make a knot. So I keep doing that and I turn it turn it again and you'll feel it like you, you'll feel it um, go from flat to like knotty so you'll know exactly, you know, that it's working. Yeah, 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 red lock maintenance, it's fun, good times. Yeah, so that's a little bit better. It's a little bit closer to my scalp. Oh, I got a lot to do. Okay, so that's it. That's my how I do dreadlock maintenance um, with new growth. Hopefully it will help you guys out a little bit. And um, if you have any questions, comment below. I will go ahead and put a link to the crochet hook that I use um, for my dreads so that you guys know. And... Um, that's it. I'll be doing, um, eventually I'm going to be doing a video on how I make the actual extensions from hair itself, from regular hair, regular extensions, how I go ahead and dread them. I've already done a video on the attachment, so check out my videos. You'll see that one. And um, that's it. Like, subscribe, and all that fun stuff, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye. Have a good day.